I like to think of myself as an optimist. And so, in our vast, ancient universe, with its countless galaxies, almost any life form that is physically possible is likely to exist somewhere. So there could be, perhaps should be, really bizarre aliens that have followed a different evolutionary path. Aliens that don't depend on water, but on other chemicals instead. Nitrogen is one possibility. It's a gas on Earth, but it can exist as a liquid when it's very, very cold. Minus 320 degrees Fahrenheit. So is there a world of nitrogen oceans lapping frozen shores? Where aliens have evolved in temperatures that would kill a human instantly? Life here would need chemistry very different than our own. A cold weather remix of the ingredients that make us. Ingredient number one, of course, is water. The average male holds eight gallons. So let's swap water for liquid nitrogen. There's also about two pounds of phosphorus, half a pound of salt, enough iron to make a nail, three pounds of lime, 15 trace elements, which might also work in alien biology, and then this. Carbon, 45 pounds of it. But what if carbon was switched with something else? Silicon, perhaps. Silicon has slightly different properties, but it could do the same job. With the right ingredients, ultra-low temperature life might be possible. If so, I think energy would be scarce. So things around here would move very slowly. Other possibilities are even stranger. The astronomers searching for far-off planets have discovered that many seem to be giant gas planets, like our own Jupiter and Saturn. Perhaps there are aliens made of gas. Aliens living here would need to consume something. I imagine they could use the power of lightning storms that constantly rage on planets like these. If such extreme life forms are possible, then life elsewhere in the universe could be very common indeed. There are certainly many more planets that fall outside the Goldilocks regions of stars than fall inside them. It suddenly seems like there could be life nearly everywhere you look. But ultimately, I think it doesn't really matter what aliens are made of. To me, it's what they can do that counts. Are they thinking about the cosmos too? Trying to unlock its secrets. Just as we are. 
In short, has alien life evolved as we have, and developed intelligence?